Good morning, one and all. Welcome to our social studies class. As we have all learned in our last lesson about the food we eat, we all love to have the delicious food. Am I right? So, in the same way, we are all human beings who also need food to survive and also air, water land and also the clothes that we wear is also very much needed to us. So in our topic today we are discussing about the clothes we wear. We wear different types of clothes. Am I right? Why do we wear clothes? We wear clothes to cover our body as we have all learned we have a physical structure called as body so to cover this body we have to wear clothes so clothes are very much needed very much essential for all the human beings so clothes protect us from heat where do we get heat from heat from the sunlight which emits light we get heat so we wear clothes to protect from heat, air, water and also the coldness in the climate. Whatever the cold we have, we protect them by wearing the clothes. And in rainy season, we have a lot of rains over. So we can also protect from rain by wearing different types of clothes. So here we are going to learn about the clothes that we Wear. So, you all like to wear different types of clothes, the colorful clothes. When you wear them, how do you look? You look very smart and also beautiful. Am I wearing the beautiful clothes? Am I looking good? Thank you all. So, in the same way, we are going to learn how the clothes are helpful and in which season. In, we have different types seasons in our on the, on the planet earth we have different types of seasons the major seasons are summer season winter season rainy season so in this season we wear different types of clothes let us discuss about them so before discussing them i would like to ask you all to open your textbooks and look at the picture here you have a picture so we all human beings wear different type of clothes in the mornings and in parties we wear different types of clothes and when going to sleep during night we wear different types of clothes like night dresses or the pajamas or night suit or the elder ones also use the nighties and the night clothes those are night clothes so here which clothes do you wear at night before you go to bed put a tick in a box here in the book you have three pictures given there he is asking you to tick the picture where you wear during night time the first picture shown there is a sari a beautiful party wear sari and then next is a beautiful design frock for the babies or the young ones like you where we wear in the parties or the functions next is the suit which has a pyjama and a track pyjama and a top so that is when do we wear it we wear it at the night when we go to bed so the third picture is the correct one so put a right mark over there okay then let us continue so we wear different types of clothes in different seasons like summer winter rainy the first comes the summer season which season summer season why is it called a summer because in summer season summer season is very hot because the light emitting from the sun is very sharp it gives us a lot of heat where we suffer from the sweat we release a lot of sweat in summer season so in summer season which types of clothes do we wear we love to wear the 
cotton clothes which clothes cotton clothes what is cotton we all have a plant named cotton which is white in color so we get cotton clothes from cotton plants so in summer season we wear cotton clothes we wear clothes like shorts t-shirts or the cotton frocks frocks made with a cotton like that and etc many more we wear this in summer season skirts uh, children like baby girl wear skirts which keeps us very cool so why do we wear cotton clothes the most in summer season because it gives us the cool as summer is very hot if we wear cotton clothes we can stay cool so that is why most of us use cotton clothes in summer season then next is winter season what is winter season called winter season what is winter season which is very cool we get shiver in the months of january february what happens we so october to january it's called as winter season in that month we suffer with a lot of cold we get shiver we like to cover the blanket and sleep happily so that we can st and we store we stay indoors protecting from the coldness that occur so which type of clothes we wear in the winter season we wear woolen clothes what do we wear woolen clothes woolen wool is made from the hair of the sheep or the goats we get wool from the hair of the sheep and the goats so these woolen clothes are weighed in we wore them in some winter season woolen clothes keep our body protected from the uh, coldness it gives us warm it keeps us cover our body and gives us warmness so that is why we wear woolen clothes like which are the clothes that we wear sweaters sweaters are the most commonly used woolen clothes in winter season and we also wear jackets like your father or your mother wear jackets made with a jeans or something it may be a leather one or the jeans one or the woolen one so we like to wear jackets and we also wear coats and etc we wear many clothes upon when we wear a woolen clothes it keeps our body warm then also what do we wear most of us wear caps socks gloves etc in winter season why because the floor on which we walk gives us the very cold and we may suffer from the cold or the fever so that is why we cover our hands wearing gloves we cover our head we cover our ears so that no air is passed we cover it with a cap and also the gloves and also the socks most of the small babies if you have the siblings in your house what your mother do when winter season comes as they suffer from cold and fever very quickly mother just take the take the socks and this um gloves and the caps and they wear it as we can protect from the winter these are the clothes which are worn in winter season so where do we get wool from we get wool from sheep then during the rainy season what is rainy season the you children likes this season a lot why do you like rainy season as we can play in water as we can go out and we can happily enjoy the rain yes you like to play in water am i right so most of the children love this rainy season so what do we wear in rainy season we wear rain coats what do we wear we wear rain coats which protects our body from 
rain when we go out not to what get damp with the rain what we use we wear rain clothes and go out we also use umbrellas umbrella is the most commonly used thing in rainy season we can get protected by using rainy clothes so it helps us to keep us dry what does the rain do rain drops the droplets of water so when we get damp we may become wet so this rain coat protects us from the rain and keeps us dry we may save from the rain so that no fever or our diseases any other diseases won't affect us easily so that is why we wear rain coat during festivals and at parties we wear colorful and bright colored clothes it's in festival what we do we wake up early in the morning we bath we bath we take a head bath and we dress up beautifully and also when we go to the functions or the parties we wear bright and colorful clothes to look smart and beautiful so in parties during parties or functions parties functions or at the festivals what we wear which types of clothes we wear we wear a party clothes which are colorful and bright so these are the clothes that we wear at functions and on festivals then the clothes we wear at school you all have a common school dress that you wear when you come to school what is that called the school dress is called as school uniform what you wear in school is called as uniform so we all have a uniform we all wear a same similar type of clothes in school so that is called as uniform school dress is called as uniform so what all we have learned today so we have summer season in which we wear cotton clothes like shorts t-shirts frocks etc and also the skirts so which keeps us cool why do we wear cotton clothes because it gives us cool we can stay cool that is why we wear cotton clothes next in winter season which type of clothes do we wear woolen clothes where do we get wool from we get wool from sheep where do we get cotton from we get cotton from the cotton plant so wool clothes why which type of clothes we wear like sweaters jackets coats caps socks gloves etc these are worn in woolen these are called as woolen clothes which are worn in winter season why do we wear woolen clothes because it keeps our body warm as winter is very cold we get shiver it keeps us warm next is rainy season so when heavy rain falls up and what do we use we use rain coat which keeps us dry we can as we get dump in the rain we can protect by using rain coats and stay dry and when parties when functions and festivals we wear colorful and bright colored clothes to look smart and beautiful next we all have a same uniform same dress in our school we all wear a similar dress in the school that is called as uniform so that is what we have all learned about the clothes different types of clothes that we wear to protect ourselves from heat water and rain heat cold and rain so next you have fill in the blanks all of us need clothes to dash our body blank our body what is there why do we need wear clothes to cover our body next 
clothes protect us from heat or animals do clothes protect us from animals no so clothes protect us from heat heat which is emitted by the rays of the sun cotton clothes keep us what do cotton clothes keep us cool we can stay cool in cotton clothes we use an blank when it rains when rain what do we use we use a raincoat and an umbrella so here raincoat is not given in the option so what is the other option umbrella and umbrella the clothes we wear at blank is the uniform which is called uniform where we wear in school very good next is match the followings so which clothes do you wear and in which season what type of clothes you wear is given here so when festivals what do you wear when festivals you wear bright and colorful clothes in school what do you wear you wear a uniform then clothes why do we wear clothes to look smart and beautiful next raincoat in which season do we wear raincoat raincoat is worn in rainy season next you have the beautiful pictures of clothes in your textbook in the small boxes write s for summer if you wear that cloth in summer season write it s and if you wear that clothes in winter season write w so which type of clothes you wear in summer season we wear cotton clothes and in winter season we wear woolen clothes made by wool so first is the scarf made from wool we wear it in winter season so w next is a cotton frock we wear it in exactly right summer season s next is a jacket which keeps our body warm where do we wear in which season winter season which starts from w very good next is a skirt in which season do we wear skirt cotton skirt this is in summer season so right s the next again in the next bit you have a pictures given in your textbook what are they they are the dress for certain people who work like policeman doctor student lawyer they all also have a uniform like in school we have a uniform even doctors and the doctor student lawyer policeman and many more job workers also have a uniform of their own so what is the uniform of a police it is the khaki khaki colored uniform where we have a cap police cap and a sh jacket shirt and a pant so here you see in the picture yes the khaki colored uniform is used for policemen so write the name below the picture then doctor what do the doctors wear they wear a apron and they use a stethoscope to listen to the heart beats they keep it in their ears and listen to the heart beats and check how they are feeling how the patient is so they wear a white colored apron so doctor wears apron which is white in color then student wear uniform school uniform is given there the light blue and a dark blue with a tie with a belt so that is a school uniform then what do a lawyer wear lawyer wear a black color jacket with a white ribbon called a tie so that is the dress that is the uniform of a lawyer so write it down there lawyer so what type of clothes you have to wear is we what we have all learned in different different seasons we wear different clothes so how we should wear the clothes we must always wear the clothes with our very neat wash the clothes before wearing you must get ready neatly clean and bright clothes neat clothes makes look good make us look good 
if we wear dirty clothes nobody like us so that is why always wear clothes wash them and wear a clean clothes then wash your spoiled clothes always when the clothes are spoiled when you get to your school you come to your school regularly when you go home after two days what happens your dress may get spoiled you may spill it with the food that we eat or a chalk piece or a dirt here and there so always what you have to do you have to wash them neatly ask your parents or their elders to wash them neatly and come in a new clean dress the next day okay then also what you have to do after washing them you have to dry them so that the no smell comes if you don't dry them what happen it gets a very bad smell where people cannot even sit beside you so always dry them in sunlight then next is to iron them you have to iron your clothes so that you look beautiful and smart then you have to wear them neatly this is the process of wearing a clothes so to ask your friends relatives family members to stay neat and clean and wear neat clothes that is what we have all learned today about the clothes that we wear hope you enjoyed today's class let us meet with a next lesson new lesson in the next session next class until then take care have a good day thank you